Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Hotline Topics. What do we know about the Yoruba actress Kemi Kuride? Uluwa Kemi Adetoroju, popularly known as Kemi Kuride, is an award-winning Yoruba Nigerian actress, movie producer, and an MC from Akoko in Ondo State. She was born and raised in Agege in Lagos State, where she attended school too in Oyewole Primary School and State High School, also in Oyewole in Agege, for her primary and secondary education, respectively. She then proceeded to School of Nursing in Ilishon, Ogo State. She completed a midwife course at General Hospital in Igondo, and then she practiced for like four to five years after she completed a nursing course. When exactly did she start acting? Chemical really started acting while she was in secondary school, but then she came through professionally in the year 2006 with her first role in the movie Omobewaji, starring the likes of Funke Akindele, Olaya Igwe, Ricardo Agbo, and so many other movie stars. How did she come into the limelight? She rose to fame with her exciting role in the movie Ilio Lorogun, where she played the daughter of Olumide Bakari. Aside her acting, she started producing movies in the year 2006, and then, and the first movie she produced was titled Current Alaja. Since then, she has produced more than 10 movies, including Afibisholori, Arike Reke, Ojoi, and Aboja, just to mention a few. So how did she develop interest in acting and how did she join the industry? She started acting when she was in GSS3. Actually, she was lucky to have found some people who were shooting movies right in front of her house. Then at Yanokmaja, she saw them acting and she believed that she could do exactly what they were doing. So she approached them and asked to join them. However, she was not given acting roles immediately. They accepted her and then had started to be doing makeup jobs. And from there, they started giving our capas rules. So when she knew she had interest in acting, why did she go ahead and study nursing? Well, she loves boots. Actually, she was still practicing nursing till the year 2000, when they went to Ushubo to go and act. And even while they are on set, she used to treat her fellow actors and actresses on set. The movie she saw them acting that day in front of her house was titled in me. Since then, this actress has produced and featured in several movies, including Wemimo, Ojo, Abeni, Ojoade, Satan's Bride, Ignorance, Omwaye, Afibisholori, just to mention a few. Let's talk about her personal life. This actress, Kemi Koride, has been happily married for years and she has three children. She gave birth to her last child in June 13, 2014, in Lagos State. Chemical Radio was actually reported to be pregnant after her return from the Chemical Radio was actually reported to be pregnant after her return from her trip to the Muslim Holy Land Mecca before she delivered her third child. So how was Chemical Radio able to raise her kids amidst all this and still be able to handle her career successfully? It was not easy. When she started having kids, she used to carry her children along with her to different locations. And then she used to fasten her baby on her back. While she's on location, it was stressful. That was why she had to slow down until she finished childbearing. Even to date, it's still not easy because her children are still growing up. In a month, she may not sleep in the house for up to two times. She's always on location. That's how busy this actress has been. So who is Kemi Kourile's husband? This actress is one of the actresses that does not reveal the identity of her husband for whatever reason best known to her. But she has been happily married and she has all her kids for the same man that she has been married to. So what is Kemi Kourede's age? Also, this actress does not reveal her age. However, she celebrates her birthday in July every year. And she makes sure she releases stunning pictures on her social media platforms to, on her social media platforms to celebrate her day. Even some years ago in the year 2016, on July 24, she had, she had a three-in-one event to celebrate her birthday. The event was on the 24th of July 2016 at Bamora Hall in Kudiru at Abiola Way, Ikeja, Lagos State. During this three-in-one event, she premiered at two movies, Eru and Ala Shirimi. Alaji Wasu Alabi Pasuma Oganla and his band were the ones to spice up the occasion and had color to the event. This actress is grateful for one thing, that she has been in the industry for close to two decades and she has never for once thought she was going to quit or relent. She just kept moving until God paved the way for her. She has been reaching her set goals.
controversies this actress is one of the actresses that has been somewhat free of controversies however there was a controversy when she received an suv toyota suv as a christmas gift this talented and beautiful actress got a car gift from a certain car dealer who she claimed to be a godfather according to this fast rising nollywood actress she announced on her page that her godfather who is a motor dealer surprised her with a toyota suv for her christmas while her industry colleagues were celebrating her online some of her fans frowned at the gift as they felt like romance might be covertly involved while well, this was coming amid rumors that the obscure lifestyles of actresses were being financed by rich men in and outside of nigeria however apart from this these actresses controversy free does she have any endorsements yes she does she actually announced her endorsement on october 21 2019 when she was endorsed as an ambassador for only glow beauty skincare the actress was excited and then she wrote in the caption while meet the newest brand ambassador in town she came with these lovely kids We have come to the end of this episode and Yoruba Nollywood actress Uluwa Kemi Adetoro Ojo. We hope you enjoyed this episode and learned one or two new things. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.